Hi, my name is Sandy Terry and welcome to my studio. So I kind of like to think that George O'Keefe is the one who taught me how to paint. I grew up in New Jersey, very close to Manhattan, and I went to a, um, a show in Manhattan when I was about 19, and it was a show of George O'Keefe's work, and it was in a private home. It was chalk full of her work, and it was just like one masterpiece after another after another, and for a young woman to see George's work like that was just so moving. So when I first retired, I felt like a kid let loose in the candy store because it was like, oh gosh, I got to do all these things that I have not been able to do because you know I'd be marking papers till late at night and whatever. So um, when I first started to even paint for 15 minutes was um, demanding and I would go back every 15 minutes to look, you know, am I getting it, am I not getting it? But at this point, I'm, I'm really much more intentional about everything that I'm doing. So I take my own photographs and then this is the basis for the painting that I'm working on now. I find somehow in the process of creating the painting that they become more three-dimensional. And I'm not trying to make them perfect. I'm trying to capture more the feeling that um, that particular image evokes for me. This was a fairly early piece, but this piece is really significant because this piece was kind of like when everything came together for me. So it's called Awakening Blaze. My work is evolving. When I first started painting, I was lucky if I could do a three or four, five petal flower. <laughs> And now I love the complexity. So this is, I've been painting now for a decade and I love the complexity. And I find that that's, it's like I'm always taking one more step, one more step, one more step. And every piece that I make enables me, the more complex I make that one, and that then it enables me to do something even more complex. So again, this is me going deeper and deeper in the complexity of the work and I'm loving it. It's, a, it's very challenging. It's like running a marathon to create something like this. Um, but at this point, that kind of a challenge uh, is something that I really enjoy. Um, and I was really pleased when this one came out because these yellows, the yellow golden colors, they're really hard to work with. And so it was really fun. It was fun to you know, create a new challenge for myself and push myself to a whole nother level. Uh, I'm doing something that I absolutely love and other people like them too and it's uh, so my friend who's the calligrapher you know she said the real the real um, challenge is to she said make something that you love and in the process of making something that you love you will find your appreciative audience and her words have just stayed with me if you make something that you love you will eventually find your appreciative audience who's also going to love what it is that you are creating for someone who was a school teacher and marking papers 10 years ago, this is, has exceeded my wildest dreams that I'm able to do this and to even to get the recognition that I'm getting is beyond anything I could have ever imagined. Thank you for coming to my studio. I hope you enjoyed the, the tour and a little bit of the story behind how, why, and um, what I create.